Hello again, John Miller, Patterson Kia in Wichita Falls, Texas, with yet another product comparison. Uh, this is the Kia Soul versus the Nissan Rogue. Uh, again, I'd like to start in the pocketbook. Uh, the Rogue is approximately $3,000 more than the Kia Soul if you go top of the line. Base models are approximately $8,000 difference, the Kia Soul being uh, around $16,000 the road being a little over 24,000. What you get for that is you get a five-star rated vehicle compared to a four-star in safety, uh, including head-on collision. You also get, uh, when you go top of the line, you also get uh, standard equipment such as 18-inch wheels, um, fog lamps. Uh, on the Nissan Rogue, it's a 17-inch tire, and you can get the fog lamps, but it is an additional charge. Again, the Rogue is a little bit bigger vehicle, has a little bit more cargo space, but it does not have the 60-40 split in the back seat, which means if you need a little bit more length, you have to bring down the whole seat and you lose all of your passenger compartment in the back. With the Soul, you have the 60-40 split, which means if you have something long and thin, you still have room for two passengers in the back with the one seat down. Again, talking about the back seat, the shoulder and headroom in the uh, Soul is more than it is in the Rogue, even though it's a smaller vehicle. You also have more legroom in the Soul compared to the Rogue. Come and see me, John Miller at Patterson Kia in Wichita Falls, Texas, for a test drive today.